Hello teachers, students, and parents. Welcome to the Reading and Writing Station. Today we are learning to recognize middle sounds and words. Recognizing middle sounds and words helps young learners improve phonemic awareness, word decoding, and spelling skills, enhancing overall reading and language development. Don't forget to download and print today's lesson. I put the link in the description box below. For this activity, you will need pencils, crayons, scissors, and glue sticks. Teachers, if you and your students enjoy our interactive lessons, please hit the like button, share with all your friends and colleagues. Most important, please subscribe to the channel so you can get notified about other videos we post and we will get the credit we deserve for all the hard work we do to create these interactive learning videos for you and your students. Students don't just sit and watch our videos, they actively participate in the lesson. All you have to do is download the lesson. Enjoy the activity. Okay, boys and girls, let's get started. Today, we are going to find the missing middle sound. Take a look at the word, boys and girls. This is the beginning sound. This is the ending sound. We are going to find the middle sound. We're going to cut out the letters at the bottom, and all of these letters a, E, I, O, U are all what? They're vowels. So it's missing, the word is missing the middle vowel. You're going to need your scissors. First thing we're going to do is we're going to cut out on the dotted line all the way across. And we're going to cut out our letters. And if you've worked with me before, what is it that you know? Do you remember? Yes, I like to cut out. Do all my cutting at once. So that I'll have all my letters in front of me. And I don't have to keep going back to cut. Cut once and you're done. What are the vowels again, boys and girls? A, E, I, O, U are vowels. And what do vowels help us do? It helps us write our names and words. Exactly. It helps us write our names and words. I'm sure you have your name tag on your table. And if you look at your name tag, boys and girls, you know that you'll see that one of these vowels or more, one or more vowels are in your name. A, E, I, O, U. Do you know how many vowels are in your name? I have one, two, three, four. I have four vowels in my name, four. How about that? Okay, now the cutting's done. Now we're going to make sure that we have all of our cutouts, that we didn't lose any. If you have your pencil box, you can just put your uh, cutouts in your pencil box. That way you won't lose them. Let's count our boxes. One, two, three, four, five, six. 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. That means we should have 12 cutouts. Let's see. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Very good. I didn't lose anything. Okay. Before we start, let's read our directions. Because the directions tells us what to do. It says, find the missing middle sound. Cut and paste the middle sound, then color the pictures. And that's exactly what we're going to do. Take a look at the first word or look at the picture. 
These are our picture clues that are going to help us find the missing letter. This is hat. Say it, boys and girls, hat. Now let's sound out the word hat. 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 Okay. What sound do we hear in the middle? We know that this is this is ah. This is t ah. So we're missing ah. What sound is ah? What letter? A. Exactly. Okay, you're gonna need your glue stick. And remember, you don't need a lot of glue, just a little swirl. And you know what I'm going to do first for the first section. I'm just going to go ahead and put my glue inside. So we have. A goes here. This is why you cut all your letters out. So you have them all ready. Take a look at the next picture. He, the arrow is pointing to his leg. Say it. Leg. Sound it out. L-E-G. Leg. Eh. Eh. What's eh? What letter does eh write? E. E makes the sound eh, leg, L-E-G. Very good. We're doing great. The next picture is pen. Eh, mm, eh, eh. Not eh, eh. Sometimes students get those two letters mixed up, those two sounds. This is eh. I, exactly, I. The next word is picture is log, log, l, a, g. Your turn, l, a, g. We're looking for a, a. What letter makes that sound? Oh, yes, oh, yes, oh. Log, L O G. Ham, ah, mm, ham, ah. We know that this is A because it has the same sound as that up there. Ham, ah, ham, H A M. Mop, mm, ah. Mop. Ah. What sound did we say makes that? What letter did we say makes the sound? Ah. You're right. Oh. Oh. Very good. We finished our first row. Let's say the words, boys and girls. Hat. Leg. Pen. Log. Ham. Mop. Very good, boys and girls. We're building our vocabulary. Okay, you're going to need your glue stick. So we're going to give it a swirl all the way down. Very good. The first picture is zip. Z. I. P. Zip. I. We're looking for I. I. Here it is. I. I makes a sound. Eh. Zip. Z I P. Tub. Tub. T. A. Uh, B. Tub. Okay. Uh. What's the uh sound? We haven't used that one yet. Uh. Exactly. You. You up. Uh. Uh. Dog. D. A. Uh, G. Dog. Ah. Uh. What makes the sound ah? Uh? Oh. Exactly. Oh. Dog. D O G. Dog. Cat, k, a, t, k, 
cat. I can hear everyone saying, A, A. You're right, it's A. We know what that is. Bus, bus, b, a, uh, s, bus, a. Uh. What's the uh sound? You, you, bus, b, u, s, bus. And the last one is bed, b, e, d, bed. And there's only one letter left, e, and it fits perfectly. Very good, boys and girls. We did it. How about that? We got to say all of our words now. Let's review. We followed our directions. We cut and pasted the middle sounds. Let's say the words. Hat, leg, pen, log, ham, mop, zip, tub, dog, cat, bus, bed. Very good, boys and girls. Now it's time to do our my favorite thing. Color the pictures. I'm going to fast forward the video and I'll be right back. Okay, boys and girls, we did it. I know you did an excellent job. Okay, don't forget to write your name at the top of the paper. And parents, please do not, parents and teachers, please do not forget to hit the subscribe button so that you can get notified when we post new videos for your students and child. Also, so we can get credit for the hard work we do. We don't allow your child to just sit and watch. We make them an active participant by actually giving you the activity to work along with us. Hope you enjoyed the activity. See you next time.